Hey everybody, welcome to the Apke Brothers channel. In this video, I'm gonna go over reviewing a land deal step-by-step -step in Tennessee. This is a 7.6 acre parcel in Fayette County, Tennessee that one of our members has under contract for $37,500. Now, when we do land deals, we aim to double our money. So when I'm reviewing this deal today, I'm gonna see if it has a sales price around seventy-five dollars to $80,000 at least. There are three key steps when evaluating a land deal. The first key step is looking on the computer, looking at the contour lines, floodplain, wetlands. Step two is looking at the price. So you are looking to see if the price makes sense based on what you have learned with the contour lines, floodplain, wetlands, and all those other features that we are gonna go over. And finally is step three, is the legal due diligence, which is calling the county for surveys, calling the county for the deeds, and making sure that all that lines up to make a great deal. Let's get to it. So here is the parcel we are going to be reviewing today. Like I said, it is 7.6 acres. And as I click in here, you can see the information, 7.6 acres. It's in Fayette County, Tennessee. The first thing I'm gonna do on ID.land is just review the physical features. And what I mean by that, we're gonna hit contour lines and see if there's any slope. Each one of these lines is the amount of feet above sea level. So this is a very, very flat parcel. The second thing I'm gonna look at is floodplain. Does it have any floodplain? As I zoom out here, you you can see this parcel has no floodplain. This is a relatively dry area. You can see some floodplain down there. So that checks out. And then wetlands I'm gonna look at as well. You can see it's got a little creek or maybe a little stream down here in the southern corner. That is no problem at all. You just wanna make sure when you see things like this off the road, make sure that you have buildable area off the road, which I don't think is gonna be a problem. The next thing I'm gonna do is go up to the base map. And what I wanna do, right now we're on MB satellite. I want to click through these other satellite images. And the reason being is these satellite images are all given at different times. So I wanna make sure that nothing is alarming on any of the satellite images. Okay, so clicking through these other satellite images, just looking through, just is a very normal treed parcel. Everything looks very straightforward. Here is the Google Earth image, and I do see something. I don't know what this is, to be 100% honest, and I see a little small structure that's probably abandoned up there. What you wanna do down the line if everything else checks out is get drone pictures of this before you buy the property and put your $37,000 out, you want to make sure that this property checks off all the things. So go through this and make sure that this is nothing of concern. Honestly, from this satellite, I'm not 100% sure what this is. I'm going to hit infrared as well, see if there's anything alarming. The thing that does catch my eye with whatever this is, is this was put recently. Like I said, Google Earth um, or these satellite images are all different time periods. It was either put recently or it was taken off. But you, what you wanna do is get drone pictures, get boots on the ground so you can analyze the deal further. So all in all guys, this deal, as far as the land perspective, as far as looking at the contour lines, the wetlands, the floodplain, the water features, all this checks out amazingly. You have fantastic road frontage, everything looks good there. The next thing we wanna do is look at price. So let's see exactly where we are in Fayette County, Tennessee. So you can see here is the county outline and we are just southwest of the center of the county. So that is where we wanna find comps. We do not wanna find comps across the other side of the county, ideally. You wanna find comps as close to you as possible. All right, so we're on Zillow and we're gonna to go to Fayette County, Tennessee and we are gonna search by land. You wanna make sure you're searching by land. We have this selected lots land. And then since we have seven acres, I'm gonna do this up to 20 acres and I'm gonna go down to five acres. So I'm looking at any comps five to 20 acres. And again, the key is when you're close to a big city, especially, we don't want comps over here. This is not where our land is. This land is much more suburban in terms of close to Memphis. We want to get comps that's a little more rural, a little closer to Somerville, and we're right around this area. So this is going to be a great area in terms of where to look at comps. Okay. So right off the bat, we have 7.6 acres here. You can see 7.17 fire that sold for $130,000. We have five acres that sold for 70. This feels like a much better comp. This seems like an outlier and too expensive, honestly. But continuing to go down, we have six acres for 125, five acres for 110, eight for 147. The thing you do wanna double check is you wanna make sure you're comparing apples to apples. And a lot of these parcels that are more expensive are farmland, cleared land. Our land is not farmable. It's not cleared without a crazy amount of work. So you wanna make sure you, ideally we can find a comp that is a treat comp. So I'm gonna keep 
on scrolling down, here we have a comp, five acres that sold for 110. So that looks like, again, that looks like it was probably this comp because that's the five acre one. So that is not a great comp with that being all farmland as well. Here's this six acre parcel here. So this was a subdivision that they did. Six acres sold for 120. This is a little treat, which makes me optimistic about our parcel for sure. So like I said at the beginning, we're under contract for $37,500. We're gonna be all in after closing costs for $39,000 or so. I'm gonna keep scrolling down. What you also wanna do is click and look at for sale. What are we competing with? Okay, we have five acres for sale for $70,000 that is sitting on the market. It has not sold yet. So that's a little alarming. Even though we do have 2.5 acres more, there is a parcel and you can see this is a treed parcel and it is sitting on the market. So that could be a little concerning. We have five acres for $90,000, 15 for 180. Keep on scrolling down. Other than this five for 70, there's not really anything concerning that it's for sale on the market. So after looking at this, after looking at the comps, I think you're going to easily double your money on this deal. This appears to be a great deal. So wrapping this video up, guys, this is a deal in Western Tennessee. This appears to be a great deal where you buy for $38,000, $39,000, and you'll sell around $80,000, $85,000. It's a very straightforward deal that our member closed on and is purchasing and is reselling. So I'm very excited for that deal. And remember, the three keys to evaluating a land deal. Number one, look at the computer. Look at the physical aspects of the land. We did that. That looks great. Land looks flat. It's treed. A little bit of that water feature going through. Number two, looking at comps on Zillow, on Redfin and seeing that the price makes sense without a doubt on this deal, the price makes sense. And finally, number three, which we didn't do on this video is calling the county, making sure you get the survey, making sure you get the deed, find out the legal aspects of the land to make sure you know what you're buying and that it is a legal transfer from owner to owner. Other than that, guys, thank you so much for watching. If you have not already, and if you enjoy videos like this, give us a subscribe. It really helps us push this mission forward, everything like that. Let us know in the comments what other videos you want me to do like this. Thank you so much. We'll see you next time.